Hey, my precious babies. I want to show you how to use this Kami app. Uh, it's new to me as well. And uh, I think we can work on this worksheet together. I'll show you some examples, but you may not copy my answers. Uh, you may not copy my answers, please. All right. Let me show you how to use a few different things. All right. The first thing it asks you to do is over here in yellow, rewrite the words nonfiction narrative than definition below. So here's something you can do if you highlight a part, right? See how I highlight? Nonfiction narrative text, a type of writing in which an author explores an experience using descriptive details and events. Wowie zowie. And then it says that you should rewrite that underneath. And I, I honestly love that. Ooh, purple. It might be hard to read, but that's okay. So let's see. It said nonfiction narrative text. A type of writing in which an author explores an experience using descriptive details and events. Right now, it's possible that you don't know what that word descriptive means. Well, look. Use the dictionary to look up a word on any page to find the word in the margins. Oh, okay. Well, what if I were to highlight, I'll go click on dictionary, right? And I highlight the word descriptive. Ooh. Well, there's a few definitions here, but I think I, the one that seems to work best in context here is um, seeking to describe, describing in an objective and non-judgmental way. Hmm. I like seeking to describe or serving to describe. So I got to find the margins, right? Find the margins. The definition was seeking to describe. So I might put in the margins over here. Descriptive uh, aiming to describe. Right? Boom. I've got my definition there. Right? Now, take a look at these three directions label conflicts big and small with emojis. Well, let's just look. Um, my parents, however, were concerned that she was getting too old to drive by herself. One night I overheard them. Well, that's paragraph five, and they're concerned that she's driving by herself. So what I could do here is go down. They were concerned. My parents, however, were concerned, right? Go up here to the emojis. And what seems to show that they're concerned that she's getting too old or she'll get sick. Oh, I like this one. See, it's one of those, uh, what is it? You know what it is. Can I make it bigger? Let's see. Hmm. Doesn't appear that I can make it bigger. Nah. That's okay. You can still see what it looks like. Right? Ooh. Right? So that's me finding a conflict or a problem, labeling it with an emoji. Ooh. Number two, use numbers one through four to rank the four most important paragraphs. That's still the text box here. So I might just put that... Here, now this is just a sample. This doesn't mean it's the most important paragraph. It's just, I'm showing you how to use the, the thing. All right, you can do the thinking and other stuff kind of on your own, that's a point. So we've got a number one there. And then you might think the next one is the, the you know, second most important. I might put a number two there, all right? And then maybe you'll scroll down to the next page. So whoa, and maybe you think that is a, the third most important or Maybe you think the 12th paragraph is the most important. It's, it's all just random, right? Right now, you won't be random. You'll do it on your own. Finally, use Google search to provide four additional illustrations. Ooh, one time, the time I'm writing about, circumstances were not normal. My parents had grounded me for the weekend of Luis's party. Well, hey, yo. We got a party coming up. And I'm going to check... Google search. Okay, and I'm going to type in the word party in 
and click search. Ooh, COVID-19 party in the house. Loading image, click to drop. And then I'm gonna shrink it so it doesn't disrupt the text, the, the beautiful story. So I wish you wanted to go to a party and boom. And the directions ask that you do that four times. So you will do this on your own after checking the dictionary, because I certainly did not remember it, right? You'll number the paragraphs one through four from important to uh, one, first is the most important, fourth being the fourth most important, right? There are more than four paragraphs. Where you see a conflict, right? You will provide an emoji that matches the conflict. You provide the definition of nonfiction narrative text up here. All right, you'll do that. And then when you're done, uh, I believe all you'll have to do is uh, save it. And you just go to a little save thing here. Boom, my drive, save now, download. I would download it. And I'd show in folder. Make sure it doesn't stay in your downloads folder. You'll want to drag that bad boy over here to your Google Drive. And all of a sudden, boom. Okay? All right. I wish you best of luck. I'll try and practice this with a few of you.